In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use Microsoft Designer to create stickers. Now, you can see here I've entered in the prompt, a smiling mango wearing a suit and tie, and it's generated me these stickers, which I think look pretty cool. I like this one, and I can go ahead and download this as a sticker with a transparent background. So I'm going to show you how you can do that in this video. So what we need to do is head over to Microsoft Designer. The easiest way to do that is just to search on Google Microsoft Designer and then it should be the first one that appears. Now, once you get here, you will need to log in to a Microsoft account. You can log in with any free Outlook account. So you can see in the top right hand corner in the profile icon, I'm logged in with my Outlook account. Once you've logged in and you're on the get started page, you can obviously see your projects once you've generated them in the my projects section. But if you go ahead and scroll down, you can generate images, stickers, designs, and so on. For this video, we're going to be focusing on the sticker creator. So go ahead and click try it and then it will take you to this window and it will show you some stickers which have already been made and what prompts they've used to generate these stickers. So obviously with any AI image generator, you need to be specific with your prompt. So we're going to create a prompt together and we'll see what it can give us. So for this prompt, I'm going to create a sticker around a burger. So let me think and then I'll enter in a prompt. So we're going to go pretty crazy and try out this prompt, a dancing burger with legs and arms holding a speaker. I'm going to put here a dancing cheeseburger. Now, this is really testing the limits of this sticker generator. So it, we'll see here what it generates. So we'll click here, generate. And then once it generates, it's going to generate two different images and we can choose which one we want. So we'll just wait for it here. OK, so this is what it's given us and it's given us two Quite different images, to be honest. This one, well, I don't know. This one looks more high quality. This one looks more cartoony. So I guess if I wanted to be specific about the style, I could also be specific. But in terms of our prompt to image, it's actually done a really good job of generating a sticker. So we can click on which one we want. We can then download it. So if you click download, it will then download that as a JPEG file. And if you just take a look at it, here is your sticker. It actually looks really, really good. So that's how you can generate stickers with Microsoft Designer.